Today we want to show you an exercise to strengthen the shoulders and the arm muscles and it is called rowing. And you find it on our exercise poster in the aerobic section and it's the exercise number six. And Jim Stephen will show you how to do that. So first we start with centering and with grounding. And that's, by the way, something which you always want to do in the beginning of your rebounding session. And we just imagine that that would be the beginning of your rebounding session. So take a deep breath and bring your concentration in the points between your hands. And for that, you put one hand on your tummy and the other one on the back of your, uh, of your back. And now with an inhaling, you concentrate in the point in your center between the hands. And then exhaling again, and with the next inhaling, again you concentrate and bring your awareness in the center between your hands. And then you can let the hands go and concentrate on your tailbone. And imagine that at its end there's a long grounding cord. And this grounding cord goes deep, 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 deep into the earth, into the center of the earth. And uh, it could help you probably to imagine a very heavy anchor hanging on this grounding cord. So you're really, really rooted in the earth. That is very, very helpful for rebounding because it gives you a lot more stability. And now we come into the exercise itself. Come into a gentle bounce, please. So the feet, you see the feet like Jim Stevens' feet are parallel and in hips width. And then we go in the exercise by stretching the arms forward and the palms are down and then with an inhaling you bring the arms towards you and build fists and then again you stretch it forward and then with an inhaling you bring the arms towards you now it's important that you um, when you are pulling towards you uh, that you contract the arm muscles it's really an isometric exercise and when you are letting the arms go forward, you are relaxing the muscles. Okay. Another thing where you want to pay attention of is that you have the shoulders nicely hanging and not lifting them up. Jim Steen, can you just lift them up and do the exercise with lifting up? So that's not how to do it. So you don't do that. Okay, and it looks also awful, you know. <laughs> okay, so let the shoulders drop. Uh -huh. Okay, and then a second thing where you want to pay attention on is when you're pulling it towards you that you're not pushing uh, your uh, your chest forward. So Jim Stephen is doing it wrong now to show us how not to do it. See? Okay, and now do it right, please. That's it, exactly. So you stay in your alignment and you pull strongly your muscles and then relax. Pull and relax. Okay, now we're going into the exercise. We are doing three sets of three, two sets of two, and then 12 sets of one. And we start into coming into nice bouncing. And the ground position of the arms is in front of you. And here we go. And one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three, and one, two, one, two, one, two. One, two, and one, two, one, 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 and nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Great, and relax, relax, relax. Shake out the hands and relax, 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 relax. And come to a standstill. Okay, that was it. Rowing. Thank you, Jen Steven. Our pleasure. The end of our eighth episode. I hope you enjoyed it. It's springtime and it's time to get our bodies toned. The exercise which you learned today is ideal for that. I wish you a great week and I'm looking forward to all your comments and questions and bounce in good health.